Hey guys, Mike here, and this is my one year review of the Ulanzi desk mount stand. Now I use this to hold up my digital camera and I record stuff on YouTube and it helps a lot because I'm able to maneuver the camera exactly the way I want it. I can get it as far or close to me as I want and I can get it at the right angle and I can even do like face down product review shots. So in this video, I'm gonna tell you six things that I really like about this and I'm also gonna give you specific use cases on how you can use it to make better content. The first thing that I love about it is the ability for it to do top-down shots. So if you see right here, this attachment allows the ball head to go at a 90 degree angle. And when you do that, you can attach your camera to it and get these types of shots. So specific use case would be, let's say you're filming a cooking tutorial and you wanna get like a top-down view of that or maybe you're doing a product review and you wanna use both your hands and still get the shot. So this is gonna allow you to do that. The second thing I love about this is the flexible arm. So this arm is actually 29 and a half inches, but you wouldn't see that from this shot because what I did is the arm comes in three sections, but I actually removed the middle. But I liked it so much that I bought a second one. So check it out. This is what it's supposed to look like. One, two, three, but because I put a camera on it and I wanted a really steady shot, I removed the middle one and I just connected the first one to the third. And that is what you're seeing over here. So that basically allows me to set the camera up exactly the way I want it at the right position so I get the right shot and it's gonna be really stable so it's not going to go up and down and wobble while it's on my desk and I'm filming. And over here on this one, I use it to just hold my iPad and I bought a separate attachment for that on Amazon, but um, I use it to hold my iPad and that is where I read my script. The third thing I like about this is the vertical adjustment. So right now I've got it pretty high and let's say I'm trying to capture a product review shot, like a box shot down here and I want the camera a little bit closer. Well, there's vertical adjustment right here and you don't even need to have this tightened down like you can if you want, but just the, the length of the arm actually just holds it in place because of leverage. But if I want to, I can drop that down and get the perfect shot. Now, this part is gonna be hard to show you, but at the top of this pole, when you get to the very top, there's gonna to be a quarter inch hole. And in that quarter inch hole, you could attach lots of different things to it. You could attach like maybe a ring light or maybe a webcam for live streaming. So I'll try to show that to you. And I like the fact that this is on a ball head. So you really can adjust this however you want. I think the build quality on this is really good. And if I'm just watching something, I'll just use all three of these arms. But if I'm filming, I'll only use two. Um, the build quality is great, but I mean, you can only do so much when you have leverage and physics working against that. Either way, when it's fully extended, it should be able to hold 4.41 pounds. Overall, this has been a main staple in my filming workflow, and I'm definitely happy with it. So thanks for watching this video, and I hope it's been helpful.